Okay, I did it three different ways. I came off the tabletop, I was real aggressive, came in here, wow, look at this berm, hit this berm, went nowhere. I couldn't even catch any air off the tabletop. You come in this and you see how soft this is, right here. Your bike just sinks. There's no way you can get any traction coming out of here and I see people all day long hitting this berm, you know? Second time came in here, jumped tabletop, little less aggressive, turned it, and I started sliding my back in. I just caught the end of the berm with my back in, and I was on the tabletop, on the gas, off it. Scrubbed off my momentum a little bit when I hit that, but I stayed at all this stuff. The third one came off the tabletop, was the least aggressive, slowed down early. I was out here, right here, made my turn early, cut it back to the inside, and I almost jumped the whole tabletop. I stayed out of the soft stuff, I took my time and I was on the gas sooner, getting traction and I almost jumped the whole tabletop. So that's, in one turn I had three different ways of doing it and the last way was probably the most consistent, maybe feels the slowest coming into the corner but is the fastest coming out of the corner and that's where you want to always think of is how you come out of the corners, not so much of how you come in.